Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to another unplanned YouTube video. So, here's the thing. There was this game that came out recently. Um, or I I don't know when it came out or when the trailer came out. But I've just seen it today and it's called Steel Rising. It's basically like a steampunk kind of a game. Uh, where machines or automatons in like the early Victorian era. Uh, and it's kind of, it's, it's, it's like, it's a really good... Um, I've seen a little bit of it. I didn't see most of it. I decided to make like a reaction video to it. So I have a proper raw reaction, you know? So, uh, yeah, let's, let's check it out, dude. Um, I've, I've seen that it's, um, it's like a steampunk game, which it's like Life of Pi. If you guys have Life of Pi, <laughs> Life of Pi, no, Lies of P, Lies of P. It's like Lies of P. It's like the Pinocchio game, which came out with a trailer, but I don't think they gave a proper release date for that one. So we, we, I'm not sure when that's going to come out, but that also looks a really good game. But this one has a proper release date. It's out on Steam with a release date on the, on September 9th, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. But we're going to check it out. Um, let, let's let's see how it is. And it should be fun. Let me see if I can get this on 1080. Yeah, definitely. 1080p. Beats. All right, let's check it out. Steel Rising. I'm guessing they don't have the music in the game yet because it's still in its early stages of the game. Oh, is that like a convertible weapon, like Bloodborne? Yeah. So all the all the enemies are machines. So it, 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 they're definitely going for the soul spawn aspect of um, of the game. So it's like a Soulsborne steampunk game. As far as I can see. Oh, what are those? Oh, look at that shield, man. I think that's our default weapon. Oh, and we're dead. <laughs> Aegis is broken. Oh, is that like the... It, it it's it it definitely reminds me of um of the assassin creed's uh inventory hud where you get all like all the weapons and then your level and on inventory and all that stuff so it, it has the reminiscence it looks really good man i wonder if you can change your armor oh this it's definitely not running at 60. it's, it's choppy uh, well, obviously, because it's like a video. I think it's not uh, recorded 60 frames per second. Or anything higher than that. Yeah, we can see the roughness. But still, though, it looks like a really good... When the game comes out, you can definitely adjust the settings and all that stuff. Is that a chest? Why don't you open that one? Ooh, the, the Bloodborne Chariot where it takes you to... Oh, dude, look at the map. Wow. So I think this is like our uh, fast travel map, uh, uh, map vehicle. You, I don't think you can fast travel from anywhere. You gotta be in one of these carriages to take you anywhere. Dude, the environment looks really nice, dude. Oh, what's that? Air dash. Freeze attacks. That's new. Oh, <laughs> is that a boss? That's creepy looking. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's, it's definitely got that soul spawn kind of a fi um, feel to it. They're go definitely going for that. Even the HUD. It, it, so it's got a stamina system, obviously, and it's got the health bar and the items on the side. If you can look at, look down below on the left-hand corner. I'm guessing those are your souls. So definitely a heavily Dark Souls or a Soulsborne-inspired game. But in the Steampunk, which, uh, which I'm not complaining. 
when it, it when it comes out with proper music and stuff, it's gonna be nice. I feel like this and Lies of P. That has a release. What did you remove? Did you remove like grenades from a back? Oh, they didn't show the killer animation. Oh, that's a new art. No, that's the same one. Interesting. The environments really are good. reminiscent of Bloodborne. Got a grappling system. Nice. So I'm guessing it's like a proper open world exploration kind of a game. Oh, you do have armor. That's pretty nice. You do have armor. Okay, okay. I'm digging this already. You have sick armor. Let me see. Bump up the audio a little bit. Yeah, apologies for it being choppy. I should have found a sixty, a really good, um, good, really good sixty frames video or something. But it's fine. I just wanted to check it out, make a quick reaction video. It's like, why not? Let's record it for YouTube as well, right? Oh, it's got a parry mechanic. Okay. I have, I have yet to see reposts. I've yet to see reposts or uh, critical attacks, as they would call it. You call repost in Bloodborne. You call them repost. Oh, this is like a sub boss. I'm I'm thinking, did enemies always have like a health bar on top of them in any Souls games? Elden Ring did have it, right? Huh. There you go. Still rising, dude. Yeah, it looks really good, man. Um for like a steampunk soul spawn game really looking forward to it and it's coming out in september so we got a couple of months uh but in the meantime um also a shameless plug i'm, I'm doing a variety of gameplay on on my twitch that's twitch.tv slash pre raptor so um i recently started playing ikai and darkwood and i also wanted to play a little bit of alice i've, I've found that game because obviously i got inspired and i was looking for different steampunk games and i got alice right alice on the pc version so we're going to check that out and it's going to be fun. That being said, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for watching the video and I'll see you guys dudes in the next one. Stay safe, take care and peace.